There is a lady called Helen Keller. Helen Keller was born deaf, blind, and dumb. She could not hear, speak, or see. And so it became so difficult to handle this child. The parents could not deal with the child completely. And because of that, the child also became very violent because no one would handle her easily. She was just very violent because it was difficult to understand what she wants. It was difficult to suggest anything for her because she cannot see, she cannot hear, neither can she speak. And so the parents got a lady who was partially blind. And this lady was teaching the deaf and the blind. But she had never dealt with the case of a blind, deaf, and dumb at the same time. So it was very difficult for this lady to handle the child too. Then one day as they were playing together around the water tap, water dropped on the hand of Helen Keller and the lady realized that she sensed the water. And so she used her finger to write on her hand water. Then she noticed that she could pick the filling on the palm and relate it to the water. And that is how she discovered how to teach and how to talk to Helen Keller. Helen Keller ended up becoming a global inspiration that wrote many books and inspired lives. One of the famous quotes of Helen Keller is that when a door closes, another one opens. But oftentimes we focus on the closed door that we fail to see the one that has been opened for us, a quote that has inspired many people. Now, if you look at the story of Ellen Keller, you always feel like all her doors were closed. She could not speak, she could not hear, neither could she talk, but she still found a door and became an inspiration globally. If you are watching me right now, then it means you are better than Helen Keller. Now, if you are better than Helen Keller and you're looking at your life and still not seeing any door around you, then it means that you are only seeing with the compound physical eyes. If you look at your life keenly, you discover a plethora of opportunities around you that you can take advantage of. You discover the uncommon gifts that are bestowed in you that you've never taken advantage of. The moment you hear someone is saying that if only this person did this to me, or if only I had better education, or if only my parents were rich, or if only I got married to a rich person, or if only, if you hear someone mentioning the word if only, then it means that person is standing on the closed door and is knocking consistently and ignoring the other doors that have been opened for you. If you lost an opportunity, don't spend your time on the complaint counter of life. If something passed you, if someone did you wrong, if someone rejected you, then you don't need to stay there. Learn from Helen Keller that many doors are open for you. If only you can stop wasting your time, if only you can stop investing emotions on the doors that have been closed. Sometimes a lot are around us, but we don't see because we have been blinded by bitterness. So we spend our time and years being bitter on the people and the circumstances that broke us and ignoring the circumstances that can make us and create a bright future. Once again, just to repeat the quote of Helen Keller that if a door closes, another one is open. But oftentimes, we spend much time, we focus on the closed door and fail to recognize the one that has been opened for us. You have more than Helen Keller. You can do more. Thank you.